morning. This is Shirley from Shirley's World again. I thought I'd just uh, try to catch the birds here. I've been sitting by the bird feeder and I'm going to uh, just turn this around just so you can watch the bird feeder because they've been <coughs> they've been coming here and uh, they should be used to me sitting here. I've been sitting here for 15 minutes. So the birds are feeding. I filled the bird feeder this morning. I don't know if you caught me uh, outside doing all my morning chores or not. Uh, it was, I had my mic on, which I have still have on here. And uh, I just did my letting the chickens out, feeding the cats, and uh, filling the bird feeders, and all that stuff. So I thought I'd come on here while I'm finishing up my coffee from breakfast. I had a nice ripe cantaloupe for breakfast. It was delicious. Slice of cantaloupe with a little salt on it. And then I had my oatmeal with blueberries and my cup of coffee, which I'm finishing now. So, I don't know if I can make this bigger or not. <clears throat> I always have trouble making the screen bigger when I'm on Periscope. Maybe you can't do that, I don't know. I think I've done it before, though. So, uh, what's everybody doing this morning? For the day. I have to run to Aldi and maybe I'll hit the Goodwill store. It's right across the little street from it. I haven't been there in quite a while. See if there's anything I can't live without. I am on a, on a really tight budget. So I'm shopping, trying to shop mostly at Aldi. Uh, and I need some oatmeal, which I get there, and some pure maple syrup, which I get there. Uh, I've been using pure maple syrup as my sweetener. It's a pure organic maple syrup, and it's, it's sweeter than sugar. It gives it a wonderful taste to your coffee or your oatmeal or whatever you put on it. Tea, it's really good in tea. Uh, I know I'm trying to cut down on carbs and sugar, but I just can't go without any sugar, so at least this is better than white sugar. <clears throat> I do have the organic cane sugar and the organic coconut palm sugar, which is a little bit like brown sugar that I use, but I really am liking the maple syrup taste and everything. You can't really detect a real mapley taste, so it's just a good sweetener for most everything. Pure maple syrup is expensive, so you have to find a pl good place like Aldi to get it. I think, uh, I don't know how many ounces it is. <clears throat> if I get up here and look, the birds are going to go away. <coughs> But it's a, it's a good size, you know, regular size bottle, and it's six ninety nine. And I know you can pay a whole lot more for maple syrup. Hi, Master Flower. Is that how you pronounce it? Thank you. Thanks for joining. And I'm just sitting here with the birds. There's, uh, I get, the birds I get, that's a little nut hatch. And that's a flicker right there with the red head. <clears throat> the bigger one. I get uh, a lot of chickadees. Uh, the flicker comes all the time. I get cardinals. They usually come in a group. And they usually come really early in the morning, I found out. And that little guy right there is a little... Uh, not hatch. He's really cute. <laughs> they sort of can hang upside down and eat the nuthatches because they they uh, also get 
I think bugs out of trees. They have a bigger, if you notice, they have a, a long, a real long beak. So they get, uh, they hang upside down on trees and get things too. Of course, I get the sparrows. That's the little nut hatch on the pole. <laughs> and uh, I get a tufted titmice. Little, uh, they're cute too. They're little. And a blue jay now and then. But this this feeder's a little big for the a little small for the blue jay. He likes to go on the bigger one in the back. But I get a good uh, array of birds because I buy the better bird seed and it has a lot of things in it and a lot of sunflower seeds, the black oil sunflower seeds. That's the trick. Don't buy cheap seed with a lot of millet in or all you'll get are sparrows. So I get, even if I get a little... There was the tufted tip my mouse. Uh, sometimes I get a little less expensive bird seed and that but then I buy a big bag of sunflower seeds and add it. So it probably comes out to about the same price. But I am going to try to save money. Everybody says if you write your menus for a week at a time or two weeks or a month at a time. I don't I'm not that organized to to do menus for a month. And uh and then shop just maybe every two weeks or every uh some people shop once a month. I don't know if I could do that or not. But uh, we went to the barn yesterday. Today's my daughter's birthday. My daughter Michelle's birthday. I gave her her birthday present yesterday when we were at the barn. She had a riding lesson, really nice riding lesson on my horse Preacher, who she's going to be riding for a while. Uh, he's an older, older gentleman. He's, I think, 24. He's uh, completely trained. He's a finished horse. He's a quarter horse. I got him when he was like maybe 17, 16, 17 years old. He had been a 4-H horse and he uh, was completely trained and a joy to ride. So I used him for my trail horse. Hi, thank you for inviting your followers, V. Thank you so much. Uh, yeah, I was, I didn't scope from out there. My daughter wanted me to take pictures from Luke Snap. Thanks for joining. <laughs> and uh, I took pictures with her, with her camera, so I didn't get a chance to scope out at the barn yesterday. But <clears throat> I had uh, made her a headband, a crocheted headband. I gave her a Starbucks card, which she loves, <laughs> gift card. And what else did I make? I make, made her a couple little hearts for in her card. So I just thought I'd come on here and show you my birds that actually do come. There's a little chickadee on there now. Oop. See, any movement in here they see, they should be used to it by now. Yeah. It's going to get warm in the next few days. Run outside? <laughs> For why? I was already outside this morning. Yeah, that white stuff, we get uh, quite a bit in the winter here in Northeast Ohio. Uh, yeah, the snow, we got a good amount of it a couple nights ago. But it's supposed to get warm. In fact, by the weekend, it's supposed to be 50 degrees, so all this snow will disappear. I hope it doesn't get warm and then turn cold, because then my driveway will be a icy mess. 
Yeah, the snow is pretty when it sticks to the trees like this. This is the heavy kind of snow that you do not want to shovel unless you want to have a heart attack. Uh, I have a man comes and plows my driveway whenever it needs it. <clears throat> and he also, uh, he also comes and shovels a path to the barn and shovels a path on my deck. He's a really nice guy. He's the one that uh, mows my lawn in the summer too. So I know him pretty well. And really nice person. So I guess I'll go for now. I want to uh, write on my blog. Uh, hi. I want to write on my blog today. I wrote on it the other day, and that's the first I've been on blogging since, uh, oh, in a month or more. So I have to get back at that. Uh, my my blog is Shirley's World. Dot blogspot. Dot com. Shirley's World. Dot blogspot. Dot com. I've been blogging since uh, twenty oh nine, so there's a lot on there. <laughs> but I have to get back to it and try to blog uh, try to blog every day or at least every other day. So I will. Uh, See you later, maybe, or, or tomorrow. And hi, Sue. It's my sister. I know she always watches these. She'll be on later. So, bye for now.